People in Baldwin County are mourning the loss of a well-known teacher and coach who died Friday. Fox News reporter Renee Diles went to Baldwin County High School where Coach Jerry Wright dedicated the last two decades of his life. The flags are at half-staff at Baldwin County High School and a black ribbon hangs on the front door in honor of a man who taught and coached life. Tr truly more than just a job for him, it was a, more of a calling. Principal Johnny Cabanis says Jerry Wright called in sick on Monday. On Friday, the school learned the longtime teacher and coach had died. He's only been out for basically about five days, but uh, it was sudden. Baldwin County Administrator Don Blanchard says he and Wright were like brothers. Blanchard says Wright had been treated for skin cancer a few years ago, but the disease came back. Just how fast it was, and you know, you always think there's a chance that uh, with modern medicine that uh, you know you can get better, and uh, it just it just got a hold to him and wouldn't let it go. It's been a couple of years since Wright coached baseball here at Baldwin County High School, but his love for the students and for sports kept him close to the athletic program. It's very upsetting because, you know, we're losing a great friend and a mentor. Baseball coach Pete Bezzaretti says the tradition room on the campus is filled with trophies and other reminders of Wright's legacy. 95% of the stuff that you see in here, Coach Wright, you know, was in his tradition that he established of greatness here in our baseball program can be attributed to him. As head coach at Baldwin County High, he led the Tigers to seven area championships and 11 playoff appearances. Wright was selected East-West All-Star Game Coach 10 times, and he was an eight-time Area Coach of the Year. He was also inducted into three coaching and athletic halls of fame. We're going to miss him, but he left a big mark behind. A mark that will never be forgotten. In Bay Manette, I'm Renee Dowles, Fox 10 News. A visitation is planned from 6 until 8 o'clock tonight at Bay Manette First Baptist Church. The funeral will be held tomorrow morning at 10. Coach Wright was 58 years old.